I, I gotta tell you, I felt like this was a master class in working together and collaboration and trust, and it was fantastic. We are Advantage Improv. I'm a bit nervous there, Hank. Uh, you know, when I get nervous, I just tend to click my ballpoint pen like this. It's a... Uh, it's a rooster pen. It is my rooster pen <laughs> from my grandpappy. That's right. Yes, and in 2037, we start our meetings at 9 a.m. <laughs> so actually, these gentlemen are going to sing you a birthday ballad. Okay. They're going to sing you a song. Poor Vicky, she's a, some kind of specialist. Just... Wow. Yeah. Let's hear it for oh, the go. Nice awesome job, job, guys. Share with us, share with your fellow scene partners here how you may apply some of this at work. We can use it to help understand our customer needs better. A lot of times we go in with preconceived notions on what the customer needs and their actual mindset or their requirements are not what we think they are. This would come in handy for product demonstrations because it's always unexpected. You never know what they're going to say or what they're going to come up with. And the yes and is definitely something that would really help in a demonstration. Dealing with things internally, if something comes up that's unexpected, um, could be anything from network to something with a product and just saying yes and now that we know what it is, what are we going to do about it? Not only for customers, but internally between our teammates, people in customer service and technical support, you know, those kinds of phrases and thought process would certainly help in working with everyone and becoming more of a team. We would like to give you a round of applause right now. Thank you so much. That's our presentation.